The next one is a reaction with the halogen. Halogen. The fifth year group element react with the halogen to form EH3. EH3 means trihalide and to form EX5. EX5 means pentahalides. EX3 means trihalides and EX5 means pentahalides. The fifth year group element react with the halogen to form trihalides and pentahalides. So here nitrogen, nitrogen only form trihalides, nitrogen only form trihalides but does not form pentahalides. But, does not form pentahalides. Does not form pentahalides. Why? Because absence of dr beta. Because absence of dr beta. In nitrogen, absence of vacant dr beta. This dr beta also vacant. The absence of uh, vacant d orbital due to such reason, uh, the nitrogen only form uh, trihalide. Phosphorus, uh, arsenic, uh, antimony, and bismuth uh, form pentahalide due to availability of uh, vacant uh, d orbitals. Uh, trihalides also. Everything uh, form trihalides, pentahalides. But nitrogen only form trihalide, but not form pentahalide. Why? Because absence of vacant d orbital. Next. Next, next. The trihalides. The trihalides and pentahalides having covalent nature. The trihalides and pentahalides having covalent nature except BIF3. Except BIF3. So, this BIF3 having more meta, which is having ionic nature because. Bismuth is 100% metal. Chlorine is non-metal. A bond between metal and non-metal is called ionic. A bond between metal and non-metal is ionic. That's why except BAF3, the remaining all are covalent behavior. Next, the pentahalides are the pentahalides are more covalent than trihalides. The pentahalides are more covalent than trihalides because of higher oxidation state because of Higher oxidation state leads to polarizing power. Higher oxidation state leads to polarizing power. Leads to polarizing power. The element having more polarizing power. The element having more polarizing power the element having more polarizing power readily form readily form covalent bond the more charge indicates 
मोर पोलराइजिंग पवर मोल पोलराइजिंग पवर इंडिकेट रेडी टू फॉर्म कोवलेंट बॉन्ड नेक्स्ट नन व्हाट इज ये ई एक्सट्रीम इन एग्जांपल थ्री ना ई मींस फिफ्थ ग्रुप एलिमेंट हो एक्स मींस हैलोजन ई एक्स फाइव मींस पेंटा हैलाइड हो ई एक्स थ्री मींस ट्राई हैलाइड नेक्स्ट नन ना रिएक्शन विद ऑक्सीजन रिएक्शन विद ऑक्सीजन reaction with the oxygen the reaction with the oxygen so here fifth uh, year group element uh, react with oxygen to form e2o3 and uh, e2o5 that means it will be form uh, trioxides and pentoxides so this is form trioxides as well as pentoxide the fifth year group element react with oxygen to form trioxides and pentoxides here the first one is n2o3 p2o3 ए एस टू ओ थ्री एस बी टू ओ थ्री अंड बी ई टू ओ थ्री बी ई टू ओ थ्री देनाटाक्साइड एन टू ओ फाइव पी टू ओ फाइव देना एस टू ओ फाइव देना एस बी टू ओ फाइव दे बी टू ओ फाइव दिस फस्ट टू आर नाटल आक्सइड्स नाटल आक्सइड्स एसिडिक इन नेचर नईट्रोजन नाटल फास्फर नाटल दट दी टू आर एसिडिक इन नेचर दीज आर आंफोटरिक इन नेचर This one is the uh, amphoteric. Why? Because uh, these two are uh, metalloids. And uh, last one is uh, basic. Because uh, bismuth is hundred uh, percent metal. These two are non-metal acidic behavior. These two are uh, metalloids amphoteric behavior. This one is metal. Uh, basic behavior next here except except nitrogen and bismuth the remaining oxides the remaining oxides are available in the form of dimer the remaining oxides are available The remaining oxides are uh, available in uh, dimer form. Dimer form. Dimer means two times. That's why this uh, P2O3 is available in uh, P2O4O6. This one dimer two times. P2O3 available in the form of P4O6 and. Uh, This is available in the form of P4 O10, and this is available in the form of S4 O6 and SB4 O6. This is AS4 O10, and this is SB4 O10. So here, among this acidic behavior. Trioxides are less acidic than pentoxides. The trioxides are less acidic than pentoxides. Acidic behavior. So you considering the acidic behavior, the trioxides are less acidic than pentoxides.
next trioxides dissolved in water trioxides dissolved in water to form acids trioxides trioxides dissolved in water to form acid acid suppose a trioxide is n2o3 this n2o3 dissolved in water to form two moles of hno2 two moles of hno2 equation balance here hno2 is called nitrous gas so this is nitrous gas n2o3 dissolved in water to form acid suppose considering pentoxides to considering pentoxides this pentoxides dissolved in water to form ic acids pentoxides dissolved in water to form ic acid pentoxide formula na n2 o5 this is dissolved in water of h2o to form two moles of hno3 nitric acid uh trioxide gives acid pentoxide gives ic acids next reactivity towards metal reactivity towards metal reactivity towards metal simply reactivity with the metals reactivity with the metals so here the fifth year group element the fifth year group element react with metal to form binary compounds to form the fifth year group element react with metal to form binary compounds to form binary compound like uh, ca3 n2 calcium nitride nitrogen oxidation state minus 3 calcium oxidation state plus 3 criss cross method ca3 n2 calcium nitride then uh, calcium phosphide ca3 p2 ca3 p2 then uh, one more is uh, sodium arsenide sodium arsenide na3 as sodium is metal sodium arsenide etc so if you want stibinite zn3 sb2 zinc zn3 sb2 so whatever it may be totally two elements are present that's why binary compounds so reaction with metal na no? the fifth year group element react with metal to form binary compounds of calcium nitride calcium phosphide sodium arsenide zinc zinc stibinide magnesium bismuthide magnesium bismuthide means simply the formula is mg3 bi2 magnesium bismuthide 
Next the topic is uh, nitrogen. Nitrogen. So simply the formula is uh, N2 nitrogen N2 N2 right now nitrogen is commercially prepared by nitrogen is commercially prepared by liquefaction and fractional distillation of air liquefaction and fractional distillation of air liquefaction and fractional distillation of air next nitrogen is prepared in laboratory nitrogen is prepared in laboratory nitrogen is prepared in laboratory by treating aqueous solution of ammonium chloride by treating by treating aqueous solution of ammonium chloride with the sodium nitrate aqua solution of uh, ammonium nitrite nh4 uh, cl aqua solution of sodium nitrite na no2 like this sodium uh, nitrite here what is uh, product means uh, n2 plus uh, 2 moles of uh, h2o plus uh, na cl is the uh, product aqua solution of ammonium chloride react with sodium nitrite so this is sodium nitrite sodium nitrite this is ammonium chloride ammonium chloride the ammonium chloride is react with sodium nitrite to form di nitrogen like n2 next one more nan in this mo in this method in this method small amounts of in this method in this method small amounts of n o and h n o 3 is formed as impurities so this is impurity so j e point of view important this is normal preparation of nitrogen what are the impurities means n o and h n o 3 so next preparation and thermal decomposition of next thermal decomposition of ammonium dichromate thermal t a nade thermal 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 decomposition of ammonium dichromate thermal decomposition of ammonium dichromate gives di nitrogen so ammonium dichromate formula nh4 taken twice cr2 o7 thermal decomposition means simply heating process like this n2 and 4 moles of h2o plus cr2 o3 the ammonium dichromate and thermal decomposition to form nitrose this is called ammonium dichromate ammonium 
डक्रोमेट नेक्स्ट द वेरी वेरी इंपारटेंट वन है ना बेरियम अजाइड बेरियम अजाइड बेरियम अजाइड वारारा सोडियम अजाइड बेरियम अजाइड आर सोडियम अजाइड ऑन डर्मल डिकंपोजिशन ऑन डर्मल डिकंपोजिशन टू फॉर्म वेरी प्यूर नाइट्रोजन टू फॉर्म वेरी प्यूर नाइट्रोजन बेरियम अजाइड आर सोडियम अजाइड सो लाइक दिस बेरियम अजाइड बी बेरियम बी ए सपोज बेरियम अजाइड बी ए एन थ्री टेकन ट्वाइस बेरियम अजाइड बी ए एन थ्री टेकन ट्वाइस गिज रेस्ट अन गिज रेस्ट डेल्टा बी ए एन थ्री टेकन ट्वाइस दिस इज अजाइड अन स्ट्रांग हीटिंग टू फॉर्म बेरियम प्लस थ्री मोल्स ऑफ नाइट्रोजन सोडियम अजाइड एन ए एन थ्री ऑन डर्मल डिकंपोजिशन टू फॉर्म टू मोल्स ऑफ एन एंड थ्री मोल्स ऑफ नाइट्रोजन दिस इज वेरी प्यूर नाइट्रोजन द वेरी प्यूर नाइट्रोजन इज अपड बै यूजिंग ऑफ बेरियम अजाइड आर सोडियम अजाइड right 2 minutes read nan